The six is scratch, so the five starters are rolling up and behind. The Metro Home Building Center starting gate. It is post time for race number two. Upstairs for the call to track announcer Vance Cameron. Doc Awesome, Hamak Maximus, Nolan's Magic Sway. Catch the spark, luckiest man alive. Scratch down to a field of five. They're on the gate here in the second. Top of the stretch. They're approaching a start. Rough and pacing. Catch the spark leaves out. Doc Awesome along the rail. Between them is Hal Mac Maximus third. Then fourth at the rail, Nolan's Magic's way, and luckiest man alive will trail this field at the eighth ball. Straightening up the back stretch, led by Doc Awesome for Corey McPherson. Ducked away second along the rail, that's how Mac Maximus up into third is Nolan's Magic's way. Now catch the spark has gone to plan B, backed up to fourth and trailing the field. That's luckiest man alive on by the first quarter mile and Doc Awesome, the fraction center, 29 and two. Open this one up. Second is Al Mac Maximus racing from third. Nolan the Magic's way. Fourth catch the spark. Trailing fifth. Luckiest man alive. They're in programmed order as they move towards the opening half mile. And Doc Awesome will be the midway point leader. Al Mac Maximus, the textbook two hole rider, racing third. Nolan's Magic Sway. There goes Luckiest Man Alive now. Underway fourth, trailing the field. Catch the spark, 59. Two was the half mile. They move around that paddock turn, chasing Doc Awesome over to the 5 8 pole. How Mac Maximus is two lengths off the leader. From the outside, third, Luckiest Man Alive. Fourth is Nolan's Magic Sway. Catch the spark. Trails the field, the three quarters up next. Doc Awesome still there from the outside. Luckiest man alive right there in the pocket. How Mac Maximus third. Nolan's Magic Sway fourth. Catch the spark fifth. Three quarters dripped in one. 29 and one. They're an eighth of a mile out. And Doc Awesome trying to take them all the way. Luckiest man alive. How Mac Maximus. Nolan's Magic Sway way wide. Deep. Stretch now four of them across the track. How Mike Maximus Doc Awesome all the way for Corey McPherson. Second is How Mac Maximus, luckiest man alive. Third time for the mile in one fifty nine. Flat. Well, the four catch the spark and the five luckiest man alive pushed out early there but had to go to plan B as Doc Awesome and McPherson got the respect off the rail. They had to go to plan B. They took back. Doc Awesome was left alone on the front, 29 and 2, half 59 and 2, 129 and 1. Another first over effort here from Lucky's man alive who raced great here from McGuigan off the pocket trip. Barrio sitting in the two hole with the two Hamac Maximus. They're going to make their way up the pass lane, take their shot down the lane, but not enough as Doc Awesome fends off the challenges on both sides to get it done. He's in the middle there, and he's going to land on the line first. Doc Awesome gets it done in 159. Nice trip on the off track.
Doc Osom arriving at the second race winner's circle by pacing gelding three by all bets off from the McArdle Dam. Mac Osom, only Alan Goody and Mike Cameron of Summerside, bred by Steve Taylor of Kitchener, Ontario, trained by Dwayne McCochran. Corey McPherson put him on top at every call. The Colt picks up his fifth lifetime victory today. The mile 159. Doc Osom in the second. <laughs> 